want you to understand, we don't have a lot of staff here. So you're going to be working a lot of hours. Is that okay with you? I fully understand, sir. I just, I, I need to make enough money for, for a big day. Well, son, you got the job done. <laughs> Thank you so much. Now get to work. John? John? John! Your shift ended six hours ago. What are you doing here? I, 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 I can't go back home. I, I need to make enough money to surprise my girlfriend with an engagement ring. I hate to break it to you, but you're not going to make it simply by working here. Look around you. How are you going to be making any money when there's nobody here? I'll deliver food. That's actually not a bad idea. I never thought about delivering the business to the customer before. John, that is... Wait a minute. You traveled here by foot. You don't have a car. I'll walk. You're going to be delivering food all day. Anything for the money, boss. Well, whatever you say, kid. I'll get the business set up today, and every call we get is going to be for you. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. All right. And don't let me catch you sleeping here again, or else I'm going to have to send you home. Hello? I told you not to sleep here overnight, John. I told you not to sleep here overnight! John! I specifically told you that you couldn't sleep here. This is not a hotel, and I will not have you living here treating it like it is just because you work here. Or I should say worked here. I'm sorry, kid, but you gotta go home. I can't have you here anymore. I'm sorry, sir. Hey, honey. I'm home. I got a surprise for you. Alice? 